Hello everyone. So a CT coronary angiography is performed by putting a IV cannula inside the vein and then putting a small amount of dye through the vein and then subjecting a patient to a CT scan. After that we are able to tell whether this blockage inside the coronary arteries or not. It serves as a gatekeeper whether we need to perform a coronary angiography or not. It helps us tell whether there is significant blockage or no non-significant blockage. It has a very high negative predictive value. If it tells us that there is no blockage, then there is no need to go ahead and perform an invasive coronary angiography. But if it tells us that there is moderate or significant blockage, then I would like to perform an invasive coronary angiography. The difference is that in an invasive coronary angiography, we put a small pipe or catheter through the artery which and it goes through the aorta into the coronary artery and then we give a small amount of dye and visualize whether there is a blockage or not. It is the gold standard test from which we compare the various other tests in investigation. In a patient with a very calcified vessel or a patient with a previous stent or a previous CABG, I would like to perform an invasive coronary angiography as it gives us more diagnostic information.